before the first two or three years after the Second World War, a new title would often sell out within a few months of publication. However, unless public demand for the book was unusually high, they were rarely able to reprint it. With paper stocks strictly rationed, they could not afford to use up precious paper or tie up their limited capital with a reprint. The uniquely scented flavor of vanilla is second only to chocolate in popularity on the world's palate. It's also the second most expensive spice after saffron. But highly labor-intensive cultivation methods and the plant's temperamental life cycle and propagation mean production on a global scale is struggling to keep up with the increasing demand for the product. Weakness in electronics, auto, and gas station sales dragged down overall retail sales last month, but excluding those three categories, retailers enjoyed healthy increases across the board, according to government figures released Wednesday. Moreover, December sales numbers were also revised higher.
a national study into fraud by bookkeepers employed at small and medium-sized businesses has uncovered 65 instances of theft in more than five years, with more than $31 million stolen. Of the cases identified by the research, 56 involved women and 9 instances involved men. However, male bookkeepers who defrauded their employer stole three times, on average, the amount that women stole. As we progress into the 21st century, communications are becoming faster and faster. Think of the millions of different media images you are bombarded with every day. It is as important now to be able to read and make sense of those images, as it has been to be able to read ordinary text. Electronic discourse is one form of interactive electronic communication. In this study, we reserve the term for the two-directional texts in which one person using a keyboard writes language that appears on the sender's monitor and is transmitted to the monitor of a recipient, who responds by keyboard. The trip for the professional training will start soon, so pack the items before we leave. Hypothetically, insufficient mastery in the area slows future progress.
essays with few or no citations will raise the concern of the lecturers. Many undergraduate students go back home to stay with their parents after graduation. I will be in my office every day from 10 to 12. Newspapers across the world reported stories of presidents. The United Kingdom is a constitutional monarchy and parliamentary democracy. The wheelchair lift has been upgraded this month. I can't attend the lecture because I have a doctor appointment. We need to make sure the school principal knows about the changes. We're constantly looking for ways to bring industry and agriculture closer together. There is a limited amount of departmental funding which is available for qualified students.
Wilson came then from a different world, and he became the focal point of a broad mainstream American culture that thought that modern literature and wanted modern literature to be able to be read and appreciated by ordinary people. They were not modernists in an abstract sense, and certainly some of them, like T.S. Eliot and Faulkner, were too difficult for some of their writings to be read by ordinary people, but this was a world before the division between the brows or between elite or whatever had established itself as part of our consciousness. Wilson was a major player in the successful effort of his generation to establish at the heart of American life an innovative literature that would equal the great cultures of Europe. And he knew that the great cultures of Europe were there. He was not a product of a narrow American studies kind of training at all. He joined a high artistic standard with an openness to all experience and a belief that literature was as much a part <coughs> of life for everyone Thermodynamics, all right, let's start. Thermodynamics is the science of the flow of heat. So thermo is heat, and dynamics is the motion of heat. Thermodynamics was developed uh, largely beginning in the 1800s, at the time of the Industrial Revolution. It's the taming of, the st of steel, the beginning of generating uh, power by burning fossil fuels, uh, the beginning of the problems with CO2 and the global warming. In fact, it's interesting to note that the first calculation on um, the impact of CO2 on climate was done in the late 1800s by Arrhenius, beginning of the generation of power, moving heat from fossil fuels to generating energy, locomotives, etc. So he calculated what would happen to this burning of fossil fuels, and um, he decided in his calculation, he basically got the calculation right, by the way. But he came out that in 2,000 years from the time that he did the calculations, humans would be in trouble.
when your bone is injured and broken, what would you say you have? What do you call the person who plays musical instruments as a job? What do you call the computer you can carry with you? How many eggs are there in a dozen? What do we call the piece of paper that proves you have bought an item? How do we call that animals and plants preserved in the rocks? What do forks, spoons, and knives belong to? What is the opposite of division in mathematics? What is the act of students to be present at school? What are the people who study history and historical evidence? What order is a bibliography usually listed in? Which symbol is used to complete a sentence? 